Hey, what's up everyone? Welcome to a brand new video today. I got an email for you guys that is quick, easy, has lots of instant XP, but also has a little bit of a AFK XP sprinkled in. So, if you if you, you get the best of both worlds, but if you want a map designated to only instant XP or only AFK XP, I recommend you check out some of the other videos that I posted before, since you'll be able to simply choose whatever video you want, or you can simply subscribe and be on the lookout for more videos like this. But, the code for this map will be appearing on your screen once you log into a map, but it will also be down in the description if you simply want to copy and paste it. Also, if you're new around the channel, thank you so much for clicking on the video. You don't know how much it means to me and the channel to simply have you here. We're over a thousand subscribers at the moment, and that's just a number that blows my mind every time I see it. I recently, well, uh, almost a month ago or something like that, I uh, we just reached a thousand subscribers, and I did a giveaway of a free battle pass or free skin to some of you guys, and. I picked three winners, and the three winners have already received their uh, the, received their reward. I'm sorry for those of you who didn't win. I'll I'll be doing more giveaways. I I just need some time and well to reach certain milestones, but I won't be wasting any more of your time. I really want to thank you all so much for all that you've done for me, and it may not seem like much, but it really means the world to me. So let's let's get started. So first thing. First things first, I'm going to wait 10 minutes. Why? Let me explain. The longer you wait, the more XP you get, but I usually recommend waiting 10, 15, or 20 minutes since you don't wait that long and you get a bunch of experience. You guys can do it instantly, wait an hour, 3 hours, 30 minutes. It's really up to you, but I would love to know how much time we waited and how much XP you got. So, I'll do a small cut and I'll be right back with you guys. Alright everyone, I already waited the 10 minutes. Now, let's get straight into it. By the way, this is a recording that I had to do after because for some reason my voice wasn't caught up by the recording, but... First things first, I got myself a sniper. I hope this isn't a big a big problem, but the first button that I'm gonna show you, it's over to the right of where we spawn, or you simply get a look for this circular statue on the background. This one is the AFK XP button. So why are we going over for this one at first? Well, this was the one that will activate, well, the AFK XP and will give us XP while we do all the other buttons, which may not be uh, a huge amount, but still, it's better to simply have a constant flow of XP while you still earn huge amounts in the middle, you know? So, by the way, I recommend you grab a boost pad since it will cut your building time in half. And all you have to do is simply go all the way over here behind the statue. And we're going to have to do something uh, that I will show you right here, but it's ramp floor. And that is count as one building right here. I hope I, hope I explained myself well, but right here... I've built one ramp, one floor, that's one, one ramp, one floor, that's two, one ramp, one floor, that's three, one ramp, one floor, that's four, and one ramp, one floor, that's five. So now we gotta look on this corner, and we'll find this button, and this button will activate the AFK XP. Now we simply gotta throw ourselves into a water so we can be teleported back to the beginning, and we don't have to walk all the way back. So. The first, the first button that will give you instant XP is over to the right of the 1v1 ramps. You gotta look over to a vault, you turn to the right, and we gotta build 12 ramps up. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12. Now we build two floors to the left. We turn to the left and we build three more floors. No, not ramps, floors. So 1, 2, 3. And on the right corner, you'll find this button that says Maya Death Run. All you have to do is simply press it and you'll be teleported in here where you have to do a very easy death run. You guys shouldn't have any trouble with this. I never played death runs and I was able to do this on my first try. So you guys shouldn't have any trouble with this. Now, quick tip, with these like Mayan uh, traps, the black holes actually shoot out the darts. So if you go underneath, the corner is always the safe spot. So right here, I get on the corner and I don't get hit. I get on the corner and I don't get hit. So now we simply reach the end and we get, we press the button that says Mayan secret. We have to do, well, you could try and simply get hit until you get teleported back, but I prefer to simply do this, the death run again to reach this button and we can simply get teleported back. So. Now for the next one, we're going to go over to the right again. As you can see, the spawn is over is over here. Well, okay. Let me simply destroy this first. And right here where it says Galactic 1v1 or to the right of where we spawn, we're going to build five, rump, uh, five floors to the front. So one, two, three, 
four, and five. We turn to the right and we build five more. So one, two, three, four, and five. But don't worry, you actually get to build onto this rock. And in front of you, you get to build five ram, uh, five more ramps. So one, two, three, four, and five. Right there, all you have to do is simply press this button on the left and you will be teleported back and you'll start earning even more XP. Well, oh, you, you're not teleported back. Huh. Forgot about that one. But now for the next one, we got to go over to this XP temple over to where you'll see this like portal. We got to look over to the left and we got to build all the way over to this torch. By the way, this is something I forgot while I'll recording this but you i recommend you use a boost pad it doesn't take that long but with a boost pad it should literally just cut the time in half now that you've reached the torch you barely have to touch the torch by the way you don't have to go over it you simply have to touch it you get to build um three ramps and then three ramps up and we build 10 floors to the right so one two three four five six seven eight nine and 10, we turn to the left and we build three more ramps. So one, two, three. And on the right corner, you'll find this button. Once you press it, you'll be teleported back. Please, so, okay, there we go. We teleported back and we'll start earning even more XP. And that's around 30,000 XP from that button alone. By the way, the first time should give you around, what, 50,000 XP? Because this is the third time that I recorded this. But now over to the left of the vault, you'll see that uh, statue on the left. All we have to do is simply build all the way over to it. As you can see, I already got myself a boost pad. And the, th the one thing that I hate about this recording is that my controller <laughs> has a lot of drift on it. So it usually just kind of messes me up, but all we have to do is simply use, by the way, the statue is not the spot where we have to go, but the statue works more as kind of like a, a guideline to know where exactly we need to go. So. All we need to do is simply go all the way to over to it and go through it or over it, literally. So you can see that there's like a mountain on top of it or behind it. We got to get on top of that one. And as you can see, the statue is behind me. And now all we have to do is get on top of this and we got to go all the way over to the edge where it seems to simply just uh, disappear. And you'll find this llama. Mm, corpse i guess and you're gonna build two ramps just like so two floors to the front and two more ramps and right here on the right corner you'll find your next xp button so now for the next one we gotta go over to this uh to this part where you'll find all where you will find all these glowing orbs over to the left of the vault You'll find all these glowing orbs and behind them you'll find a tomato head or a stone tomato head and all you have to do is simply build all the way over to it and once you reach it you don't have to barely touch it just like we did with the torch you actually get to build it build it like so and once you're behind it you get to build you get to build two ramps up so let's do that really quickly two ramps up so one two we turn to the left and we build five floors so one two three four and five, we turn to the right and we build two more ramps and on the left, you'll find your next XP button. This is the second to last button. So these are all the buttons I could find, by the way. If you guys find anything else, please let me know down in the comments. I would love to know how you guys found it or simply where you found it. But for the next button, I'm actually gonna destroy these, uh, these buildings. Why? Because we actually need to build right where I started to build, so. Right here, over to the left of the vault, as you can see, the vault is right there. We look over to the left and we gotta build four ramps up. So one, two, three, four. We, tur we turn to the left and we build two floors and we turn to the left again and we build two more ramps. Right here, you'll find on the left, you'll find this button that says secret room. And all you have to do is simply press it. You'll be teleported into this like a uh, movie or whatever. You gotta go over to the left and this, I did mess up a little bit in this part. I don't know why it was so tricky to simply get on top of this uh, wall. But all we have to do is simply uh, go all the way over to the to the biggest tree on the left. So you're gonna do a little bit of parkour right here, right here. You jump over to the huge tree, and once you're on the top, you turn your back and see the rift. You look over a little to a little to the right. You'll see this like pa a patch of leaves. 
you turn a little to the right and you'll see another one. You simply look up and you'll find your next XP button. So those are all the XP buttons I could find, but there are also ways you can earn more XP. For example, you can wait 30 minutes and you can collect every single triangle inside the vault. Each one will give you a decent amount of XP, but I usually recommend waiting only 10 minutes since to 30 minutes seems a little bit too much for me. But now we simply go over to the XP temple and there are three things you can do on this on this temple. So you can shoot this dummy. And by the way, if you're using the boom sniper rifle, like just like I'm doing, you need two shots to actually kill the dummy. Or you can press this button that will give you around a thousand XP if I'm not wrong. So all you have to do is simply press it. Well, you don't press this one, you hold it. You hold it, but on the left you'll find this purple pool that will actually make the AFK XP even better. But that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. Please consider subscribing and dropping a like. I'm uploading videos like this every single day. So if you like XP glitch content or simply Fortnite content, I recommend you subscribe since I'm uploading at least one video a day. Also, I'm trying to diversify my channel a little bit. So if you would like to see me play uh, any game in a specific, some people have asked for horror games, some people have asked for God of War. Uh, I can, I want to play whatever you guys want. I love video games and basically I can play whatever you guys want. So yeah, that's that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope to see you guys on the next one. May God bless you all. Peace.